Sales, deals, discounts. It must be Black Friday. And dedicated Best Buy shoppers braved the 25 degree weather this morning to save on their holiday wish lists. Oh, it's so cold. More stores opened earlier this year in Las Cruces, and some customers passed up sleep for savings. Best Buy off Loman Avenue opened at 5 a.m., but Josh Trujillo arrived at 8 p.m. Thursday night in hopes of saving $200 on a Sony laptop. Oh, yeah, well, we haven't slept. <laughs> We've been doing this a whole lot. A deal worth dancing for. He wasn't the only one. Hundreds of customers, some huddled in blankets, waited in a line that stretched behind the store. And those were the early birds. By noon, some four to 5,000 shoppers stopped by. Black Friday, named so because accountants use black ink to signify profit and red to signify loss, is one of the busiest days of the year for retailers. And it's grown. An estimated 138 million shoppers will hit the stores today, up from 134 million last year. Nationally, 88% of retailers are offering promotions, up from 77% last year, according to the National Retailers Federation. Maria Valles, Operations Senior at Best Buy, started work at 2.45 a.m. We are we're fully stocked in the front lanes. Cash is fully stocked. We have a register at home the uh, in home theater, appliances, computers. We have three on the side of each one, so any, anybody getting laptops or services. We have two on the customer service side for any apps or returns. We are accepting returns in the morning. Um, we've been putting out bundles so that our customers can get grab-and-go accessories. Um, we're fully staffed, and we'll be fully staffed up too as well. She expects the traffic to lull around noon and said one of the best deals was a Wii and TV listed for $3.99, originally priced at $748. If crowds, cold, and daybreak kept you in bed, not to worry. Discounted shopping extends through the weekend, with local deals during Small Business Saturday, an emerging trend, and online promotions during Cyber Monday. Reporting for the Las Cruces Sun News, I'm Christine Rogel.